right guys i just wanted to show you what the final product look like uh so this side over here is princess jasmine's side she is one years old and i feel like i got her a lot of stuff um oh, it's funny because i wanted to get her one more thing but it was a lego set and it's candy themed but i'm actually going to make that be her whole inspiration for her second birthday so i held off on it because i know she'll love it at two um but this is her dollhouse um and this over here is like all of her presents all stacked on top of each other her broom this mini mouse uh shopping center situation is hers but of course her and her sister will share because they love playing together and sharing and victoria is such a great teacher to her sister jasmine so it will be great um but this is yeah so like the house and everything over here is jasmine's and this is her gift bag as well she got things in here uh this side here is Victoria's is stuff all under and sex and everything like that um, and all around but yep this is kind of how it's looking everything is all tucked in which I'm happy because she can just keep pulling everything out because I didn't want to take up too much floor space so it looks good it looks balanced um, but yeah it's stuff all in the back and this is our beautiful tree and our candy cane um yeah this is victoria's rainbow high doll house this is her house for her christmas um we have the lol surprise house i love this so much better um it's so much open uh space in the open floor plan where she can really utilize all of her dolls all at one time I think she'll really get a lot of use out of this house. Um, this is also the car that goes with it. This is her other present. Uh, I just love that it's minimal and not just full because, you know, she can kind of do what she want with it. So, loving the Rainbow High dolls. Just clean aesthetic. She can put however many dolls. There's actually a jacuzzi that goes over here, but I took that out because I don't want no water in it. I just love that it's open space and not clutter. Um, she also got a present, a rainbow high that comes with a closet situation, so she can maybe put it there. Because the reason why I got her so many dolls and things, because that's what she does. She loves to just dress them. Accessories. I mean, she will make her own clothes out of wipes, out of aluminum foil. My girl is amazing. So, we're going to keep that going the next thing that i got victoria is a sweet shop for her dolls to go to so as you can see there's so many sweets and everything open i'll show you in here so it's a real sweet shop and so many treats and a gumball machine, of course. And plates. And she can take that all back to her house. Um, so I love this. Um, that way her dolls have a place to go. I just wanted to elaborate on what she has and make it make sense. So that way she's just not at the house and waiting for another doll just to be inspired again we can also start to create a world kind of like how american girl doll is where they have like these little worlds and you know or barbie is these little worlds as opposed to just the dolls but she has so many for this christmas so she should be good until her birthday in november like i mean if i get something it's going to be for next christmas because i think she'll do fine with everything that she has everything else leading up to next year will just be art learning stuff that's it you know we'll go on our vacations but we're you know she's good she's set um so yeah love that i am done guys i want you all to have a great christmas i know i am um 
one of my biggest joys is just seeing my kids have everything. You know, I'm not the type of mom that, you know, I don't buy a lot of Louis Vuitton and Chanel and everything like that. I can easily afford it, but I just rather buy stuff for my kids. So, you know, toys are not as expensive as bags. And I just love seeing my girls happy. Like, I will always give all of my money to them. Like, that's just me. I find joy in it and it makes me happy. So that's why they have so much stuff and they're gonna always have so much stuff. Uh, and if I was, I'm in aviation and aerospace, but if I was working at McDonald's, I would have two jobs just to make sure they have everything. I just know I grew up with a lot of toys. It made me who I am today.